Absolute zero, or zero on the Kelvin scale, is equivalent to negative 273.15 degrees Celsius, or negative 459.67 degrees Fahrenheit. Kelvin, along with the help of Planck and Clausius, developed the second law of thermodynamics. The second law of thermodynamics states that the state of entropy of the entire universe as an isolated system will always increase over time. The second law also states that the change in the entropy of the universe can never be negative. Entropy is the measure of disorder or the lack of definite probability. Adding heat to a system or a substance increases the movement of molecules and thus increases entropy. This law was formulated to explain how a steam engine works and that it is impossible to have a heat engine that is 100% efficient. Kelvin's interest in the transmission of electricity led him to become the director of the Atlantic Telegraph Company. This company was working to install a telegraph cable that went under the Atlantic Ocean. The first Atlantic cable expedition was in 1857 and was a failure. The next attempt in 1858 was also a failure. The third attempt in 1865 was once again a failure. Finally, the attempt in 1866 was a success. This created the first viable method of communication between the Eastern and Western hemispheres. This telegraph used Morse code, which is a series of multiple taps of different lengths to communicate. Kelvin later developed multiple marine instruments as he was an enthusiastic seaman. These instruments included the mariner's compass, the astronomical clock, and the sounding machine.